Hi everyone, let's start my presentation. Music can be seen as a tool for generating artwork. There is inseparable connection between music and the visual art. Music influences the visual art and also visual art influences the music. Firstly, I want to briefly talk about what I have learned in the last few weeks. I would like to start with Pablo Picasso. Picasso was a Spanish painter who played a key role in the history of contemporary art. His Cubism book, Three Western Standards of Art Since the Renaissance, Disintegration, Perspective, and the Harmonious Colors, from them on concepts and ideas are more important than drawing skills. Art history divides Picasso into three periods. Blue period, Rose period, and the Cubist period. It is not hard to see that in the Blue period, Blue dominates all his works. Blue usually gives people a feeling of melancholy and sadness. The background was blue, the characters were blue, and even the hair and the eyes were blue. In his paintings, the background is simplified avoiding the scenes of light and dips, and combining the characters into a simple pattern. The highly strong flowing lines give an unusual impression. In the works of Rose period, I found that compared with the works in the Blue period, the figures and shapes in the paintings begin to take on some geometric edges and the simplified structures. Kubist started in ancient Egypt, where the Egyptians had a strict set of rules for painting. In order to show the characters completely, the Egyptians did not base themselves on the fact they saw with their eyes. The person in the picture has his head on the side, his eyes and shoulders on the front, and from the waist down on the side. In this way, the painting will be more realistic. I listened to Schopenhauer while drawing a straight line. Schopenhauer have the characteristics of being dilute and peaceful, and occasionally showing such a little contemplation. It is easy for someone to calm down and revel in it. So Schopenhauer are very helpful in creating inspiration for painting. Draw all kinds of straight lines with the ups and the downs of the music, and empty my mind. This includes sick and thin ones, long and short ones, and there will be connection in several places or parallel. By compression, Beethoven symphonies will be more rounded and swelling. In victory exercise, we first tear the paper into eight pieces and draw shapes or objects on each piece to the rhythm of the music. At this point, I can't resist them, um, I, any ideas what the, my brain gives to me, so I just draw whatever I want, listen to different music when drawing different pieces of paper, and see what different patterns can be drawn by listening to different music. This made me understand how music affects painting, and then Put this piece together and use the color to draw in another painting. I painted the three paintings in week 4 exercise. The first one was to a black and a white paint to water, mix them together, and let them flow freely, occasionally changing the paper direction. In this painting, green, yellow, red, and blue pigments are mixed up together by my hand covered with a pieces of white paper and then moved up, down and left to right to from a second painting. The last one is to dip the brush into the paint, hold the brush high and let the paint fall freely. Finally, I found that adding water to the paint made it flow more freely. Next, I will talk about some ideas about my final project. Firstly, I prefer to introduce Wesley Kandinsky, because his paintings give me a lot of inspiration for my final assessment. Kandinsky's works do not represent a substantial image of the real world. 
and do not reflect real life. And the appealing visual from composed of colors, dots, lines, um, plans, and mechanisms. Like this painting composition 8, there is no image in the painting. It is exactly the point, line, plan. Shift is basically geometry. Actually, I think his painting are more like a piece of music. Like this painting composition 6, each form has its own laws, and each law exists a powerful impact on the whole. The picture itself is full of rhythm like a great symphony. There is a great collaboration and connection between music and painting, and they can both be used as a tools for venting emotions. And the color is the same as the note. Both have a sense of melody. Of course, Kandinsky's paintings are not only musical, but also rich in color and the unique concept of Form. I will choose Ander Skalanen Balam Dana to get my final assessment. The song was composed by John Hanstras. At the beginning of this song, it was a bright melody, a relaxed reason and full of cheerful emotions. I can see a sense of beautiful Dana River in my mind. I think this song will help my mind to be more active when I am painting. The Egyptian way of composition is very attractive to me, which I mentioned earlier, and I was thinking about how to add this element to my final assessment. I will refer to Pablo Picasso and the Wesley and Kandinsky's work like Composition 8 to complete my final assessment, because the abstract composition of their painting deeply attracted me. I will combine their way of composition and the use of color to make my own abstract painting. How to reflect the musically in the painting will be my challenge. Of course, if I want to learn from Wesley Kandinsky's um, painting method or style. I must have a certain understanding of his painting. At this time, it was necessary to read articles about his painting. Yeah, that's all. It's my presentation. Thank you.